Hi, I'm Jeremy Jewell with our Fluidy Company. I'm an applications engineer and product specialist for our collaborative robotic platforms. The mobile industrial robots utilize laser scanners to allow the robot to navigate a facility and also map a facility. So there are two. There is one in the front left corner and one in the rear right corner of the robots. They are about 10 inches off the ground and they spread this laser out to pick up walls, legs of machinery, other equipment at that level. The robot then uses that information to know where it is in a map and comparatively it uses the live data and that map to localize. That localization is called SLAM, Simultaneous Localization and Mapping. AMRs vary in that they have logic and smarts behind them. They have the ability to make decisive moves based on environment changes or fluctuations. So if someone steps out in front of the robot, as opposed to just stopping in place, the robot will actually guide itself around in a safe manner, if possible, to continue its mission. AGVs, however, automated guided vehicles, typically will follow a path in the floor that is either a tape-based or a magnetic strip-based or um, just sensors in general to guide that robot. And it doesn't allow as much um, logic or, or capability to make decisions. And that's where these AMRs really separate themselves.